Natalie and Monique, Monique Middlecoff, Natalie Hodson. Uh, one of the last I think questions we're getting is what's the difference between a hernia and diastasis recti? Oh, great question. Okay, so it's not uncommon to have something like an umbilical hernia. And so you can think about the words just as a, a mental trigger. So diastasis means separation. Diastasis recti is just referring to the location. Separation of the recti or the rectus abdominis muscle, separation. A hernia is um, where we have a tissue pushing through other tissues. So some sort of internal organ is being pressed through the external organ. So we can see them happening often um, together, but that doesn't mean that one would cause the other or one would be the kind of the precursor to the other. So as we have weak abdominal tissue, especially in that linea alba, the center connective tissue band, that separation would indicate a diastasis, or diastasis recti specifically. An umbilical hernia is where we'd be potentially having that, that uh, separation or weak tissue and we would have tissue pushing through. So the difference between a separation and a bulge. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so if yeah. you're looking at your stomach and you see a bulge, you see something sticking out, that's an indication of a hernia. If you feel a gap in between your abdominal muscles, that's an indication of a diastasis recti.